Hi, my name's Simon from Lumar Technical Team. Today, we're going to demonstrate how to change the gypsy on a pro fish. Very simple operation. You need three tools. You simply need a half inch drive. That can be a normal ratchet, it can be a wrench, it can be anything, half inch drive. Five mil Allen key, eight mil Allen key. Okay. Begin by loosening off and removing the shoulder bolt. You may find it uh, slightly tricky if it's glued in, which it, which it will be, it have Loctite. And you can see it has a shoulder section on it. This allows the top cap to move in now. And at this point, you'll notice that the uh, automatic free fall plunger is out. With the wrench, when you attempt to remove this now, you'll see that it hits the ramp. First couple of times, it's fine. Now, eventually, it's gonna knock, and you won't be able to remove the top cap. What you need to do is you need to stow that pin back in place to be able to remove this top cap. And you can use whatever you want to depress the pin, rotate that plunger, and it's now held in place. And now it will spin freely and you'll be able to remove it. Okay, at this point, half inch wrench into the top cap, release it, and then you can simply remove it by hand. Just for reference, you'll notice when you take it off that the clutch cone is actually built into the top cap. Place that to one side. At this point, you'll need your 5mm Allen key. And on this side here, you'll see there's a guard. That needs to come off. And place to one side. You'll note you still can't get the gypsy out at this point because the stripper ring is still in place. So this bolt here, you remove, and that allows you to take away the ramp, place to one side. At this point, you have two choices. You could take the stripper ring out, or you could just remove the whole assembly, which I'm doing, and then slide the stripper ring away. That's it done. Reverse the process to replace the gypsy. So at this stage, you're ready to reassemble and replace your gypsy. You must be careful at this point. You'll note on the gypsy, this face has no magnet on it. If you were to fit a chain counter, you'll see there's a pre-installed magnet. That must face the gypsy body. You'll also note on a gypsy, in these pockets are stamped the chain size that this gypsy will cope with. Again, they face away from the main body. So magnet towards the main body, the pockets that show the number on the outside. You simply lift, drop it into place. 